going on, everybody? Welcome to Second Printing. This is where we take the five biggest issues of the week from comicbook.com and put them all in one place for you. And no, they don't include a black and blue or gold and white dress. <laughs> Walking Dead fans are rejoicing. This week we found out that the season five finale will be 90 minutes long, making it 30 minutes longer than usual, which you should know. With only five episodes remaining in the season, I know it's definitely nice to get every extra bit we can from this one. Speaking of TV shows, American Horror Story is getting an interesting new addition. Lady Gaga, who has held minor roles in Sin City, A Dame to Kill For, and Machete Kills, is joining the cast of the FX Horror Anthology for its fifth season. I can't speak as a fan myself, but our commenters have some mixed and concerned feelings about this news. A new trailer for the upcoming Batman Arkham Knight video game made its way online. In the trailer for the now M-rated video game, M for Mature, Poison Ivy tells Batman that the villains of Gotham are banding together to take him down. Arkham Knight hits shelves June 2nd, and I know I'll be picking up my copy for Xbox One as soon as I can. A series of new character posters have been released for Avengers Age of Ultron. First, Robert Downey Jr. posted this image of Iron Man. The next day, we got the Hulk. And today, Samuel L. Jackson tweeted out images of Black Widow, Thor, and Nick Fury, probably to take us through the weekend. We have these images for you at comicbook.com, but more importantly than the images themselves is the fact that Robert Downey Jr. teased a big announcement in eight days from when he posted his. There was no hint or clue what the announcement is, but a lot of people are thinking it's either Iron Man 4 or Spider-Man casting. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments section. All those wishes for a CW-based Justice League might have been justified after all. Deadline reported this week that a new DC comic television series is in development featuring the Adam Firestorm and Captain Cold, as well as Katie Colts in a yet unannounced role, but presumably Canary. It will also feature three DC heroes who have not yet been featured on TV. And these shows, they just keep getting better. And the growth and expansion, how could you not be excited, people? One last bit, though, we learned this week just before filming. Leonard Nimoy has passed away. We would like to send our condolences and pay tribute to him any way we can. But those are the biggest stories from this week. Focus, starring Suicide Squad's Deadshot and Harley Quinn, or, you know, some people might know them as Will Smith and Margot Robbie hits theaters, and it is an intense thrill of a movie. I have my review up at comicbook.com. Make sure you subscribe to comicbook.com's channel for more news, interviews, and clips, and follow us at comicbook.com on Twitter to stay up to date.